Hi Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea, thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out who's missing you right now and why. And please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. One second, let me close this. <laughs> okay, better. All right. Spirits and angels, please show me for fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Who is missing fire signs right now and why? Three cups. Eight of wands. Page of swords in reverse. The High Priestess, Five of Cups, um, King of Swords in Reverse, Seven of Wands in Reverse, <clears throat> and I've got the Eight of Swords in Reverse, Two of Cups in Reverse, and the Hierophant in reverse. Hmm. Was looking so good. <laughs> Three of Cups and the Eight of Wands. And Page of Swords in reverse. Still kind of okay. And then I see the rest. Okay. Um, fire Signs. It feels like this is someone with the High Priestess here that you're not really speaking with right now. Okay. And the Swords are all in reverse. That means you're not speaking with this person currently. Um, Three of Cups, Seven of Wands here can also indicate maybe this person did put you in a third party situation at one point in time. May not always mean that, but the Three of Cups also can indicate deep down this person is missing, socializing with you, seeing you, hanging out with you. Okay, but this could also, Seven of Wands members can indicate maybe some of you, you're not really fighting for this person, for this connection. Currently, you may have given up on this person. So this person is very disappointed, right? Five of Cups here. And I feel like they're missing um, conversations, talking with you, 801s, or maybe traveling with you, doing things with you. It feels like this is someone you used to do things with, okay? It could be indoor, outdoor, with friends, with family, for some of you. Okay, but um, the page of swords here in reverse indicates that this person is actually secretly spying on you as well. They miss you, so they spy on you. It could be, you know, spying may not always mean, yeah, it could mean that they're spying on you online and on you know, social media and stuff, but this could, for me, the spying card can indicate that they could be looking back at your pictures, conversations, right? Two of Cups in reverse, so they're missing how both of you were on the same page at one point in time, but Two of Cups in reverse also can indicate maybe both of you are not on the same page right now, or could be separated, okay? This person could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, I'm seeing Taurus, Pi Pisces, also can be somebody like you are, Fire, some Fire, I'm seeing it with the Eight of Wands, but it can be any sign, okay? Hmm... I'm going to pull out more cards here, fire signs. Yep, they miss being intimate with you, with the lovers here. This person may still love you or have fe has feelings for you. And um, the Hierophant in reverse, Kenny K, maybe at one point in time, both of you could have made a pact or promised something. Uh, or could have been in a serious relationship. But for some of you, it's not. it wasn't a serious relationship, okay? For some of you, this could be uh, someone kind of new or you had a fling with this person. But for a lot of you, maybe both of you were in a serious relationship. I'm only saying that because the lovers sometimes can indicate, you know, something that is physical but may not always mean that it is a official relationship. Um, but the Hierophant can indicate that. Both of you could have been in an of official relationship, but now it's in reverse, so it no longer exists, okay? So it could go either way, just take what resonates with you. So with the magician here, <laughs> so this person, I feel like 
again, a magician indicates somebody who wears a false self mask, right? So they're not showing it to you. This is someone that you do not even know that they're actually missing you, or you may suspect a little bit, but um, I feel like they may have been acting coldly towards you or just being really silent, giving you silent treatment. Um, for a lot of you, fire signs, I feel like you, you don't actually think this person misses you. <laughs> You don't think this person misses you. You think this person is long gone. That's what I'm getting here because they're not talking with you, right? They're not speaking with you right now and both of you are separated. Um, some of you, maybe you do suspect that this person does miss you intuitively with the higher priestess here. But logic would tell you that, no, I don't think this, this person misses me. If he or she misses me, then um they would reach out then they would talk then they would do something to take actions towards me right but um but they're not that's the thing <laughs> i mean they're not taking actions towards you but they do miss you and you look at the five of cups here they're very disappointed very sad or regretful or remorseful over something that may have happened between the two of you most likely it's because both of you are separated from each other right now okay so I feel like also uh, fire signs, I'm going to spin this around for those of you, if this is someone relatively new, okay, this is a general reading, so I try to see, I try to interpret the cards in a different light, in a different perspective, um, what I'm seeing here is that with the three of cups, maybe this is someone you've been speaking with, okay, three of cups and the eight of wands here, but... There is a but, but lately, something may have happened that either could have made you feel really sad, disappointed, or that they could be feeling sad and disappointed. I feel like something could have happened. It could have been, it may have something to do with communication or because someone was partying. Someone may be suspicious that the other person is um, talking to someone else or excluded them while they're out and about okay this part again is just for some of you it's um, a little bit specific so i feel like this person actually feels left out or you could be or you could have been feeling that you you're being left out from their social life okay if this is someone new so uh, with the page of swords here and my verse and the king of swords and my verse and two of cups and my verse feels like maybe both of you are not official yet, okay? And the higher font here in my verse also can indicate that both of you may not be official yet. This could be someone you're just physically intimate with currently with the lovers here. But also what I'm seeing here is maybe this person is also kind of hiding their feelings towards you. Either you, you suspect this person is partying too much or entertaining other options or that this person could be suspecting you instead they miss like being able to do things with you um it feels more like they want okay they want to have more fun with you or do more things with you that you could you would communicate more unless it's a reversed okay unless it's them mm, unless it's you okay it's vice versa, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to pull out. I don't like saying vice versa, but this is a general reading, right? I mean, I wouldn't say that in a personal reading, that's for sure. But we've got the Queen of Swords in reverse, Ten of Pentacles, and the Six of Swords. So this person could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. For a lot of you, this is someone you're separated from, okay? At least like 70% of you. So you're not speaking with this person because we've got the king and the queen here. Both are in reverse. So not speaking with each other, not on the same page, separated. But this person wants to speak with you. It feels like that. And the ten of pentacles here because of the eight of wands here. And the ten of pentacles and the six of swords here. This person is missing either traveling with you, um, swimming with you, surfing with you. If you're a surfer, something to do with water. I'm seeing a lot of water here. Something that both of you do uh in the water or it could indicate traveling like crossing the sea being on a boat or going on a cruise honeymoon whatever okay something to do with water something to do with transportation um some sort of vehicle as well um 
and the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, this is someone I feel you're not speaking with, but both of you could have talked about the future, about taking the relationship to the next level. But if this is someone relatively new, I kind of feel like this is someone you, even though it's new, new someone you actually think or want a future with, okay? That's what I'm getting here. If this is someone new, I feel like you're very attracted to this new person. But for a lot of you, again, this is someone, someone you're separated from. This person may have, may have had an affair or kept secrets from, me, from you. For a lot of you, I feel like it, that could be it because of the lovers and the high person and three of cups here. But may not always mean that. Um, I feel like this person misses being home with you or spending time with you, with friends, with family. If both of you do know each other's family and with the children, if if both of you have children together or a child. Okay, Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape or form. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. I'll leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But these readings are still new, so they're still relevant. Um, again, check it out if you want to. I hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Bye.